Yeah, I'm going to go over something actually maybe it's fairly simple, but maybe not. Sometimes people might have a, this is in a convertible, right? So I'm in, a, in the car here. And uh, they got these two latches. It's uh, probably typical of maybe all the Sebrings, but definitely the ones from uh, 96 to 2000. And probably all of them up to 2007. But you got this hook here, right? And you got this bar. You know, what I'm talking about is if you might have a leak that's coming in through where the gasket is here. So like you open up the latch, right? You open up the latch and you notice you have a hook. What you want to do is get it so this hook tightens down more because it could be the rubber seals bad, but usually it just needs to be tightened down a little bit and I'll show you how to do that. Now this is a lot easier to do with the top down. So I put the top down and you saw all you need is an Allen wrench. There's a set screw in here and these hooks that are you know to hook the top and close it you loosen up the set screw and then you can turn this it's just on it's just in there like a regular screw that's all it is so if you got to turn it clock if you got to tighten it you just turn it clockwise a turn tighten up the set screw and that will make the hook that goes here pull the top down more you might need you know, there could be damage to the rubber, but I, usually it's not the problem. Usually it's just a little bit loose. It's not uh, connecting good. You, this rubber is the original one from 99. There's nothing wrong with it. Because no sun hits it, so it's not degraded by the UV. So it's never usually a problem. But you just got to make it a little tighter. So, And sometimes you might notice that um, your windows along the side, they might fit better and things like that because the top is pulled down just a hair better. But, you know, you might have to do separate adjustments. But again, it's like this. It's all it is. It's all it is. This set screw right here. You loosen this set screw. Um, and you might need some penetrating oil or something to get this loose. And then, and you just turn a, turn a hook one turn and see, you know, if that's enough to um, uh, tighten it down enough. Try, don't tighten it down too much. And these hooks are replaceable. Sometimes they break once in a while. Very, Not often, but they're replaceable. So if you broke the hook, just un unscrew the set, the set screw, take the unscrew the hook, put a new one in, you're all set to go. But usually the top, as the gaskets uh, get a little older or whatever the hell it is, you might have to tighten this down a bit and that'll stop your leak.